um, you know, it's awesome. Um, I've had Bone Digger from day one, and uh, we've got a pretty good bond together. Uh, Father-son bond. Uh, he loves me. I love him. I do anything for him. I've done all I can, so and we're going to keep doing what we can for him. Uh, and you can see the affection that he gives me. Um, he'll do the same thing at night. He'll come in, he'll lay beside me in bed, and he'll sleep all night in, in the bed with me. Uh, it's just it's a bond that not everybody can have, and, and I've, I've built it with him, and uh, it's awesome. Um, some of the other cats here in the park, um, believe it or not, they can sense that I'm, I'm disabled. They, they know I'm missing legs, and they can tell it. Um, some of them's built a real good bond, and then there's others, you know, that, that know I'm the weak link, you know, and I make a good lunch. But you know which ones you can build a bond with, and, uh, and not all of them will. They're like people. They have personalities. Uh, some of them like you, some of them don't. You know which ones you can. Um, these guys have all been raised and raised by me, and they love me just like I'm, just like I'm theirs. So it's awesome. Uh, it's what keeps me going. Uh, I don't know that I could do anything else. Uh, if I don't feel good, then I come out here and rub on bone. I put him out in the morning, you know, because he's usually in the house, and go on about my day. I just love it. It's what keeps me going. It's a drive. No, um, he's a little aggressive when he eats, but other than that, I know that, and he's a lion. You know, you got to tell yourself he is a lion. Um, he is 120 pounds, so I'm just 135, so <laughs> he weighs as much as I do. What about the other animals? Have they ever... Um, no, they've all, you know, they've all learned that uh, they know me. Uh, when I walk up or, or when I ride up on the terraplane, uh, they know me. They'll come up. They'll chuff. Um, They'll rub on the cages and everything. Um, I don't feel any threat by them, and they don't feel threatened by me. Some of them's had a pretty rough life, so they know they've got a little easier here. If, if, if Bones could understand every word, you know, could understand what you're saying to him, what would you look at Bones in the eyes and tell him? Um, just let him know how much I love him. He's awesome. He's what keeps me going. and letting him know that I'm going to do all I can to make him better. <laughs> and then there's the honorary tiger, Tony. Um, you know, they just, some of them can't believe it. Uh, it's just, uh, it is, it's, uh, it's, I'm going to say it's a benefit of being here. Uh, it's a benefit of building the bond. Um, not anybody can just sleep with Bone Digger. Um, some people he likes, some people he don't. Uh, we do, we have a special bond, so. Um, and they just can't believe it, but uh, he's. Uh, how do you, um, how do you gain the trust of an animal? Um, just caring for him mostly um, every day. He sees me every day. I rub on him every day. Uh, I feed him. Um, I give him. I still give him a bottle. He'll still suck out of a bottle. Uh, and he knows that. And he's just built that every day. And, and uh, he knows I'm going to be there for him. Can you tell if um, the lion's ever in a bad mood? Yeah. Yeah, you can tell if they don't feel good. You can see it in their eyes. They're like a person. Uh, you can see it in their eyes. Um, with a lion or a tiger, you can tell when they leave their ears laid down, you know, they don't feel good, they're grumpy. Um, they've, got, they've got awareness as they let you know. Oh, did we affect how you work with the lion or the other animals? Um, no, I don't let it. Uh, Anybody that's got prosthetics knows, you know, you have good days and bad days. I try not to let the lions or the cats, you know, any of the cats know it. Um, cats can tell. Uh, these are wild animals. You know, they are, their whole instinct is to stalk. So if you let them know something's wrong or you hurt or anything, they can tell it. So I, I try not to show it anywhere, in the, in, anywhere near a cage. I'm pretty strong-willed, so I've been through a lot. My pain tolerance is real high, so I, I can take a lot. Bone will let him know when he's had enough.
stand there and see if you'll... I'm just shooting your legs and yeah, turn. <laughs> Tony. Boom. You gonna snub me now? If Sonny walks over here, we look over this way. He might, yeah. Well, he would have. <laughs> Boom. Tony's aggravating. Playtime. Bone. What's up, Bone? The veterinarian keeps giving me positive feedback, so we're going the right way with him. Um, he eats once a day. He'll get, he, he's actually on a three pound diet right now. I had him on a five pound diet and he just started exploding. So he's gotten a little big. The bigger cats are getting 16 pounds a day. Two thousand. What bone? What boy? What boy? What boy? What boy? Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. What boy? What boy? What boy? <laughs> They're gonna start playing rough. Yeah, quit. I know he's back here now. He sees goats. What, Paul? What, boy? What, boy? What, boy? What, boy? What, boy?